Chapter 106 to 107 Now after a time, I took a wife for my son Methuselah. And she bore a son, and called his name Lamech, saying, Righteousness has been brought low until this day. And when Lamech had come of age, he took a wife for himself, and she bore him a boy. And when the boy was born, his body was whiter than snow, and redder than a rose. And all of his hair was white, and even thick, like white wool and glorious. And when he opened his eyes, the house shone like the sun. And he arose from the hands of the midwife, and he opened his mouth and blessed the Lord. And Lamech feared him, and he fled and came to his father Methuselah. And he spoke to him, A strange child has been born to me. He is not like men, but the sons of the angels of heaven. And his form is strange, not like us. And his eyes are like the rays of the sun, and his countenance is glorious. I do not think that he is from me, but from an angel. And I fear lest in his days something will be wrought on earth. I beg you, Father, and beseech you, go to our father Enoch and learn the truth from him, for his dwelling place is with the angels. And when Methuselah heard the words of his son, he came to me at the ends of the earth, where he heard that I was then. And he spoke to me, my father, hear my voice, and come to me. And I heard his voice, and came to him, and spoke. Look, here I am, child. Why have you come to me, child? And he answered, saying, I have come to you because of great distress. And I have approached here because of a terrible vision, Father. And now a child has been born to my son Lamech. And his form and appearance are not like the form of men. And his color is whiter than snow and redder than a rose. And the hair of his head is whiter than white wool. And his eyes are like the rays of the sun. And he opened his eyes and made the whole house bright. And he arose from the hands of the midwife, and he opened his mouth, blessing the Lord of the age. And my son Lamech feared him, and he fled to me. And he does not believe that the child is his son, but instead that he is from messengers of the heavens. And behold, I have come to you so that you may inform me of the exact facts and the truth. Then I, Enoch, answered, saying, Truly the Lord will renew his ordinance upon the earth. And exactly as I have seen and told you, child. For in the days of my father Jared, they transgressed the account of the Lord from the covenant of the heavens. And behold, they are sinning and transgressing the custom. And they have mated with women and are sinning with them. And they married some of them and they are begatting, not beings like spirits, but instead of flesh. And there will be great anger upon the earth, and a flood. 
and there will be great destruction for one year. And this boy who has been born to you will be left on the earth, and his three sons will be saved when those who are on the earth die. And he will cleanse the earth from the corruption which is upon it. And now, tell Lamech, he is truly your child. And this child will be righteous and sacred. And call his name Noah. For he will be your remnant, from whom you will find rest. He and his sons will be saved from the corruption of the earth and from all the sinners and from all the iniquities which are consummated upon the earth in his days. And after this, there will be stronger iniquity than that which was formerly consummated upon the earth. For I know the mysteries of the Lord which the Holy Ones have revealed to me and shown to me. And I have read them in the tablets of the heavens. And I have seen written in them that generation after generation will do evil in this way. And the evil will exist until generations of righteousness arise and evil and wickedness will end, and violence will cease from the earth, and the good things will come upon the earth to them. And now, go and tell your son Lamech that this boy which has been born is his child, truly and not by deception. And when Methuselah heard the accounts of his father Enoch, for Enoch revealed everything to him secretly, Methuselah returned and revealed everything to Lamech. And his name was called Noah, he who consoles the earth after its destruction. <laughs>